telling me I spent $75. For this? For this. This is, this is the size of my left nut. Like, what is this? Anyways, let me guys, let me tell you guys how this trip has been so far. We left at 4, well, I woke up at 4 a.m. to fly to L.A., right? Mad uncomfortable flight. My head was killing me the whole time. We get here. I, I needed a shower. My hair was a mess. We have a photo shoot at 12. I thought check-in, or uh, I thought the check-in was at, was at 12, was at noon. They said it's at 2, so we pulled up there at like 10.30. Weren't allowed to go in there. I went to a Planet Fitness to go take a shower, and I'm taking a shower there to fix my like hair so I can go to the photo shoot. Um, and there's no towels, so I have to walk around soaking wet, um, air drying, and then we had to go to multiple places to find food. Now we got this, and this shit's seventy-five dollars for my left and right nut, and then some salad. At least the coffee looks cool. I love LA. This is the most best place to go to. Wow. Ugh. 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 Good lord. This is, so this is where we're doing the photo shoot at. This is for, what is this? What month is, is it we in? This is for September's drop, I believe. I don't even know what is the September drop. Um, but this is pretty dope. It's a big ass. This looks like a warehouse from like movies. Still got that young Lyle on. You're a trader. Who do you think I'm sponsored by? He's a trader. Well, you're, She's cut. You're, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Alex Hubank here uploading Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Make sure you guys like the video and subscribe as we're almost gonna hit five. Hope, hopefully we'll hit 500K subscribers by the end of the year. Um, but maybe we'll go see Lex and get a workout with him and his girlfriend. If not, I've, I generally don't know what we're gonna do yet. All I know is we have to just do this photo shoot. So we're gonna do that here, show you guys. Like an industrial warehouse. Pretty, uh, pretty cool. See me twerk? <laughs> no. <laughs> Make sure you like the video, please. These are dropping on Sunday. Mm -hmm. By the time this video is live, these shirts will be up. If you guys want to cop, they're probably going to sell out dumb quick. It's going to focus. There we go. All right, we're about to go train. I already drank this. I did two scoops. This is the best, best flavor for the pump, Mango Vaniac. Um, two scoops to the dome. I'm chilling on the stimulants. I just had a little bit of coffee, um, but I'm no longer doing like stim uh, based free just because I'm trying to chill on the caffeine, keep it under like 300 milligrams a day, um, and then do like a little cleanse, go to zero, and then I'll build my tolerance back up. So yeah, we're about to go hit some chest um, with Noah. I'll show, do a little like little tip series of, you know, teaching him how to grow a bigger chest. So we're about to get into it. Right, so we're with Noah, about to hit a little chest day. He's hitting the gain sickle. This this first time trying it? Yeah. You're gonna like it. That's probably the best flavor. I always tell people to get this one. It smells good. It smells it's good. gas. So now. Is it just like a flavor? Gainsicle? Yeah, it's like pop the popsicle. The gain sickle. You just try it, you'll like it. If you like sweet shit, you should like it. Wow. Ballad? Wow, that's so good. That's, that's, that's killer, really good. bro. They do kill the flavors. They're really good at it with the flavor stuff. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah. Shout out Alpha Lion. Good company. I'm basically gonna teach Noah how to how to build like massive knockers so i'm gonna run you through like exactly what i did to build my chest all right like when i was younger i don't do as much volume now but we're probably gonna do a lot of volume because i'm gonna do like what i used to do that it would i'll run you through it so Let's do it. you gotta come out to maryland sometime well i would love to let me the know you're describing it too i was you, like you, i think you'd like the vibe i feel I like do. you fuck with it and you can hit dc you can check out dc and baltimore dc's probably better how but far like, is dc dc's like no. You'd, you'd like you'd like DC. You get yeah. some fire ass pictures there too. It's like 40 minutes away. That's sick. Yeah, you should pull up. I'm like geographically challenged right now. Okay, so Maryland is like we're on the east it's coast. Like east, east coast. East coast. Right? Yeah. Where like do you know over east there? Coast? It's nice. like yeah, like like. Because I know DC's deep, like like all the way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Fire. Yeah. Okay. And the, you're like competing, competing, like. Yeah, I'm gonna do a show, show. Like you're still mad at you. Yeah. Fire. So. I, based on how I do in the show, I don't know if I'm ever change it. Uh, you know, if I really enjoy the process of competing and like I feel like I could add on size by hopping on, I might consider it. But I haven't had like a legitimate off season with like a coach. So if I like actually bulk, maybe I, naturally I probably could add still like five more pounds. So I might see, I might do that route. I don't know. Like what are you doing? I'm doing men's physique, physique. because I'm not I'm not big enough for classic. Yeah, I, like it's like the shit where you do like 
that shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. Who judges that? Like, I don't know, bro. I, I, I have no idea. Like, yeah, good. I think it's big on like conditioning, symmetry, and like the V tapers and like. Okay, so they got, the judges like have to know what they're talking about. Yeah, yeah. Because I'd be so biased. I'm excited. Like, if I was judging like guys and their physiques, I'd be like. What I want to look like that. Yeah, yeah. That. Who's more? Like, who's more aesthetic? Exactly, yeah, yeah. So. All right. So we're gonna start with pre-exhausting. Basically, just getting some blood in the titties so that we can feel them when we go into like a like a compound movement. So this is gonna be like a little feeder set, uh, higher rep, just kind of warm up everything, get everything moving. Um, so we'll start off like that. And also, big thing is to keep your shoulders back and down. I have a labrum injury, so usually this kind of is hard on me. So the biggest thing is not keep my elbows up. I keep them back and down, and my like scapula pinched back and down. So. Yeah. Yeah. So, but not like all the time. Like I was just like, I don't know. Like I, is, I, there's gotta be someone out there that like wants to know like my workouts. Yeah, so yeah, I'm yeah. Like, let's, let's give it to him. And like good response. Ish. And I yeah. was like, damn, I thought y'all were supposed to be supportive. Like every time, like I was oh, like, some shit, some hate. Some, yeah, like the people were like, mm. they, one of the trainers was like, we're gonna do like a thousand rep arm day, and I was like. That's a lot. That's a lot. That's but a lot. Like, I've done that before. I was like, Sounds for YouTube good. video. Like, I, I want to have like that athletic and aesthetic. Body, and I yeah. think that you and I are kind of like that similar. Like, yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. Care about being the you don't got to be the biggest dude. Just look, I, I look, go with your shirt off. You know exactly, what I mean? That's how exactly. I feel. Like. Five sets of 25 reps, and people were like, Oh, they were probably trashing you. People were like, Bro, oh, nah, they were they were flaming you for that. I guarantee know, like, you. He's really gonna get away with this because he's famous. It's like, get away with what? It's yeah. like what I did. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not I, that, I bro. Like. There was like this whole group of people on TikTok who like did this optimal training thing. And again, like, I always talk about this in the last video probably, but like, I respect them for being dummy smart, like the way your body moves. But like, I train the way like I like to train. Yeah. It might not be the most scientifically like training way, like best way. Yeah. But like if I like it, I do it. I don't like if I post one of my workouts now on TikTok, people in the comments will be like, "This isn't optimal." Like, like even this workout, me teaching you how to grow chest because I have a big chest. And that's how I grew mine. They're gonna be like, "Alex, why are you telling them to do that?" Like that's how you're not how you're optimally supposed to do it. Like, like how is that bad? Like yeah. getting 25 reps. Like at least you're at least you're lifting in the yeah, first place. Exactly. You know what I mean? I was so like, confused. I was like, I'm like, bro, I don't care about being the biggest guy. Like I don't care if I'm like yeah. building muscle like on the stretch. Like hold it for like just half a second, really feel it, open up. It's all about the stretch on this. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We gotta stay under that. Come on. What I want you to not do is don't let your shoulders come forward on the lockout. Keep them kind of back and down, and like keep the tension there. Yeah, stop right there. Focusing right here. Stop right there, yep. Right there, down, yep. Really trying to activate this. Come on. Let's do uh, two more, one more after this. There you go. How'd that feel? People say like optimally like it is good for your scapula to do that, but like if you want to feel it more in your chest, okay, right, right. I think it's better to stop a little short of it. Like, That's what I'm saying, bro. It's like, like that's not optimal. yeah, like, yeah. See, like technically, like if you're trying to really target your chest, it's good like not to completely. If you're, you're going like this at the end, see how like you're kind of pushing your scapula yeah. forward, versus like I usually try to keep it back and down the whole time, and it's a stop right here. Boom, okay. boom. Technically. Your scapula is supposed to move like that, but I would say, based on what I have done in my experience, right, <laughs> maybe it's not the most optimal, is I keep it a little bit more back and down, and I kind of keep that tension, I don't lock it out all the way like that. So, that's just my two cents, all right? Don't, don't kill me for it, please.
you going? What are we at, nine? Come on. 10. Go really slow on the way down, really slow. Just finish it off, really slow. Control it. All right, and drop it. You're good. Damn, bro. I want you to like waste your energy, so I'm gonna like put them on your lap so you can like rep them out. Do you want me, bro? Put this on your leg. Big deep, come on. Come on. That's the easiest one, bro. Big deep. That's what I'm saying, bro. Easy. Big deep, come on. Big deep, big deep. You got two more. Big deep. Big deep. Keep it, keep it stable. You got the strength, it's just stability. Come on. I'm barely even helping. Dig deep. Come on. Go, give me one more, bro. Give me one more. Give me one more. Come on. Dig deep. Dig deep. <laughs> All right, there you go. Go. That was sick, though, bro. Got to get more reps in the old bag. All right? Do dips then. No, I don't. For, <laughs> well, we're not gonna do dips. <laughs> Really relax it up here. Like it's almost like you come up, like your lat, you see my lats kind of out? Try to flare your lats a little bit. Bend over just a little bit. And turn your pinky slightly towards the sky. Yeah, that seems good. Oh, my fault, my fault. You got some crazy striations though. Yeah. Yeah, partially. Right there, yeah. Do it again, one more. Lean forward. Yeah, lean forward and really pull that shit. Yeah. Yeah, let's pop it through a little bit.
All right, how's it for the workout? Noah looks absolutely crazy. Yo, comment down below if you think he should compete. Imagine. Oh, that'd be. That go crazy. Low key. I think you would do good. Thank you. I think if, especially if you did an OCB show, like a, which is like a nat naturally tested one, I think you'd have a shot at winning. Like actually, you like winning. Yeah. Like FPC is more like harder, but like an OCB, which is like a natural tested show, I think you would 100. percent I think it'd be fun. Yeah. Test your it'd body. Be a, it'd be like. Why, a, why are you doing it? Like, why are you competing? Mainly, I mean, mainly for the content for the series. Um, I, I already want to get like super, super lean and diced one more time just for the sake of getting really good content. And then as I get into the winter and fall, I want to start actually going through like a growing season. So I don't want to start, I want to start from like a really lean point so I don't have to worry about gaining fat over the winter. Okay. You know what I mean? The leaner yeah. you, like the leaner you start your bulk, the better because then you have a longer time of being leaner. You right. know what I mean? Versus if I start now, I'm already kind of fatter. So it's more of just like the time works out and I'd be a good series for people to see. A lot of people want to see me compete because they want to see how I do like compared to other people. Um, like the whole aesthetic versus like people actually bodybuilding. Right. I'm not like an actual bodybuilder, but like yeah. it'd be cool to see how I fare up. Um, God, dude, you should do that though. It'd be a good series. Okay, that'd be kind of fun. Yeah, you gonna myself a little. You gotta come out to Maryland sometime, bro. I would definitely. If if I competed, I would come to Maryland and I'd work. Does, yeah. does the guy that coached you work out in Maryland or here? Uh, he's in PA, but he he's like it's not far. There's shows oh, yeah, all I across the year, bro. Excuses. Like, I could. Low key, let's do it. That'd be yeah. fun. All right, Noah's going to compete now. <laughs> All right, well, it was good seeing you. All right, that's it for the video. If you guys enjoyed it, if you did, please like, comment, subscribe, turn the bell notification on. Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. All right, until next time. Peace out.